Welcome back. This is my offside. I'm starting to make changes around because I'm getting sick of the my offside, my offside. And people are starting to make fun of me in the street. Unless you guys like it. And if you do like it, comment. Comment, yes, right there, here, down, in the comment box. That will help my work. So, here are the top headlines of the National Teams Week. So, since everybody's concentrated with their national teams for the friendly matches, our players are shining. For example, Mascherano's team, Argentina, won two to four to the actual world champion. Whoa. No more beer for you, or uh, bratwurst, or schmilleswurst. And schlesch, schlesch. Mark, let me speak German. Last season we lost everything. Everything. Unlucky players, uncomfortable players, sadness was around, but especially fans were pissed off. They almost set fire to Camp Nou. But that's what Messi stands for. Take a look at Messi's first job. The first job he had in his life. Take a look. Oh. In the last episode, we talked about signings, but we didn't mention the latest signing Douglas Ferreira from Brazil. He was actually presented last week and I'm curious, do you think this guy will qualify for the DAPB, the Department of Arts and Performance Skills on Fires, which is headed actually by Brazilian executives Fashionista Johnny Alves. <laughs> Choreographer Johnny Alves. <laughs> Professional singer. Danny Alves. And Mr. Hood Rapper Neymar. Tu conheces esse cara? Que te pega de jeito? Que furar teu bloqueio? E te rasga no meio? É, é. That's all for today, guys. As you see, we have versatile players. Just in case they run out of money, but I don't think that will happen. So stay tuned to WeLoveAt.com and don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Twitter. It's a wrap. Bye. Bye.